Hello and welcome to Left, Right and Centre. I am Tejas Mehta coming to you live from Mumbai where for the past few days pollution levels have spiked dramatically because of a fire at the Devnar dumping ground. So bad the situation has become that the number of little children and senior citizens complaining of breathing problems has doubled in the past few days. And then comes a dramatic and alarming statement by Chief Minister Devendra Fadnavis who says that the way we treat our garbage in cities they have become gas chambers. Gas chambers exactly like the ones made by Nazi dictator Adolf Hitler. So what is the real problem? Who are the ones to really take accountability of this huge garbage mess? Let's take a look at this story first, where even actor Vidya Balan, who once lived in this area of Chambur, says that something really now needs to be done. <laughs> Relocate the garbage dumping ground. Angry residents living right next to the Devanar dumping yard have had enough. For five days now, burning garbage continue to choke the air, adding to the toxic smog. Images taken by NASA satellites still show the smoke plumes, though smaller, the fire not fully doused. Though pollution levels have dropped since the fire began, doctors say the number of patients suffering from breathing issues only increasing. Last 8 to 10 days, the numbers of patients which I was getting before this has almost doubled now. Meanwhile, the BJP taking pot shots at the Shiv Sena, which runs the civic body. The chief minister comparing the toxic fumes to Hitler's gas chambers. <laughs> प्रदूषण महामंडला बदनाम कर आग लगने षड्यंत्र होता का even as bitter allies Sena and BJP battle it out, Mumbaikers are demanding that the BMC shift the garbage dump yard in their backyard to other location. Meanwhile, another question that now stares the BMC in the face is what are the other alternatives in a land-starved Mumbai? And the BMC better think hard and fast. In Mumbai with camera person Vinayak Parker, Ankita Sinha for NDTV. And to debate all of, the, all of this, join, joining us now from Mumbai, we have from the BJP, uh, Sanju Verma, from the Congress Party, we have Mr. Charan Singh Sapra, from uh, the Shiv Sena, who is a cooperator from this area, we have Mr. Anil Patankar, joining us from Los Angeles also, we have Dr. Ritesh Gautam, who is an IIT Bombay professor, who has been studying and analyzing these NASA satellite images, which show very clearly how potent this and deadly this smog is. We also have with us uh, Sumera Abdulali, who is an environmentalist, and we are joined by a host of people here who are living right in the proximity of the Devnar dumping ground, which is less than three kilometers away from here, and are the real sufferers. Aapse shuru karte Anil ji, aapne suna Mukhya Mantri ji ka bayan keh rahe ke yahan gas chamber ban gaye hain, aur Hitler ne jo kya tha, aise hi gas chamber ban gaye the. Saaf nishana. बीएमसी के ऊपर आता है एक तरीके से क्योंकि जिम्मेदारी क्या आपकी बनती है क्या नहीं आप यहाँ के नगर सेवक हैं कॉरपोरेटर हैं जिम्मेदारी हर एक की बनती है अभी मैं बोलूँ कि बीएमसी की है बीएमसी बस स्टेट के ऊपर डालेंगे स्टेट आगे डालेगा तो ये आखिरकार ये लोगों के जीवन मरण मरण का सवाल है तो इसके लिए कार्रवाई होनी ही चाहिए आज मैं जब से चार साल से कॉरपोरेशन में हूँ नगर सेवक करके मैं एम वेस का 147 का नगर सेवक हूँ मगर तकलीफें पूरे चंबुर को हैं आज ये जो डंपिंग है ये तो इसे तो तत्काल बंद कर देना चाहिए मगर बंद करने के बाद फिर आगे क्या आगे हमें अगर जो हमारा जो कितना इलीगल डंपिंग यहाँ हो रहा है हो रहा है हो रहा है मुंबई का डेवलपमेंट इसको कारण भी मुंबई का जो डेवलपमेंट क्या है उसका रोड के जो रोड्स बनाए जाते हैं जो बीएस के काम है जो गली के काम होते हैं उसका पूरा डेवलप वहाँ ढम किया जाता है जो मुख्यमंत्री ने कहा वो बयान को आप 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 क्या मान रहे हैं कि इतना गंभीर सिचुएशन हो गया सिचुएशन गंभीर है और मुख्य माननीय मुख्यमंत्री ने वहाँ विजिट किए 
उन्होंने तो इसे तत्काल वही निर्णय ले सकते हैं कि यहाँ से उसे बांटाया जाए और जो आगे जो तलुजा के लिए जो डंपिंग का तलुजा हो चाहे आगे हो मगर अभी बस मुंबई को और मारूमत आज जब दो तीन दिन से ये इतना धुआं मिल गया अभी जो गी, गीला है सूखा कचरा बोलते तो ये हम लोग अलग अलग देते हैं मगर जाके एक ही जगह डम होता है फिर वो वहाँ जम जाता है अंदर मिथेन अपने आप तैयार हो जाता है ओके तो फिर इसके लिए अभी ये हल निकालना जरूरी है ओके ओके ठीक है हम बात करते हैं सुमेरा प्लीज कम इन यू यू हैव बीन मॉनिटरिंग द एनवायरमेंटल पोल्यूशन फॉर मेनी इयर्स ना एंड लास्ट कपल ऑफ डेज स्पेशली हाउ बैड इट रियली बिकम वेल इट्स द वर्स्ट दैट वी नो ऑफ बट वी हैव टू रिमेंबर दैट वी हैव नॉट मेजर्ड इट फॉर मेनी मेनी इयर्स वी हैव स्टार्टेड मेजरिंग ओनली लास्ट ईयर रियली स्पीकिंग and chembur has always been known to be an area where the air pollution has been bad to the extent where dr sandeep rane and other more than 15 years ago took up this case and took it to the high court those cases have had certain orders which are not being followed there have been other high court cases which are still being heard in spite of restricting the amount of dumping to which is allowed to happen it is still being dumped and in the meantime i'm very distressed to hear that people are making you know politicians are making statements passing the buck to each other when at the same time the whole city is suffering it's not only chembur the effects can be felt as far as so south who is Dubai. which is a government state government responsible the bmc responsible who is responsible i think it's a collective responsibility and it's not enough to say that each one tells the other one they are responsible i think collectively they have to find a solution and solutions are available okay. the solutions are not being found precisely because of this kind of passing of the buck and also pot shots being taken by both uh, the bjp and the shiv sena we are seeing uh, sanju varma come in here because even uh, we did see uh, ramdas kadam the environment minister you know make a very telling statement saying that uh, if the chief minister has positive intent this can really be you know uh, uh, you know solved resolved <laughs> in a matter of few days come in here because what very clearly sumer abdul ali says is that this is the collective responsibility of both the bmc and the state government uh tejas i agree with the lady in the audience uh, who uh, said that this is a collective responsibility to add to that uh, i would also like to point out that uh, you know uh, while uh, it would be unfortunate to politicize this issue Uh, because i think uh, sanitation is a larger issue uh, with wider ramifications uh, and you know this whole uh, deonar uh, dumping yard uh, which has resulted in the fire uh, you know and hence the smog in the last few weeks i think the issue uh, is also a legacy related one uh, i would like to bring to the notice of your audience that way back in 2009 the height of the deonar uh, you know dump yard was already in excess of 50 meters versus the mandated 35 meters and the warning bells uh, you know then in 2009 uh, you know more than 6 years back told us uh, that worse was to come uh, i think uh, the erstwhile congress government this is not about passing the buck Uh, we are currently in par uh, we believe in accountability so i am not running away from either accessibility or accountability that said it is important to note that you know in the last 5 or 6 years if apart from deonar the 141 acres which the current fadnavis led state government is planning to acquire to start a new dump yard or landfill in taloja had certain concrete substantive work been done on this front by the erstwhile congress government 5 to 6 years back in 2009 okay. we would not have faced the situation today because don't forget that out of more than 140 lakh tons okay. 140 lakh tons of garbage that india produces on a daily basis more than 7 to 8% of that is produced okay. in mumbai alone so the problem certainly is right, let, huge let me, let me just get charan singh sabra here you have a valid question you you have a you have a valid question let me get charan singh sabra here sir you knew this entire issue was a volcano waiting to erupt since 2009 taloja uh, area which is about 35 kilometers from here land had been marked but it was still not allocated the congress party also because you are in power then is somewhere to blame as uh, you know uh, sanju verma is pointing out no sanju verma is trying to distort the facts actually it is the responsibility of the executing authority which is bmc bjp and shiv sena is ruling this uh, bmc since 19 years 
I want to ask Sanju Verma, has BMC given uh, any plan since 19 years? It was only Congress government. When we protested, the Congress MLS protested in 2012 that these dumping grounds are to be closed. It was that I time when this process of Kaloja actually started. I am not distorting facts. It was due to the, it was due to the Congress MLS. Sanju, Sanju Verma, I, I, I was I not talking in between when you were talking. Please allow me to speak. No, please allow me to I speak. I will not allow See, you to hijack you can't, the you can't throw the responsibility on others. By disseminating lies to the audience, no, I will not no. allow you to hijack listen, the debate. Yes, listen, it is Maharaj, not only about the dumping ground, the it is about the lack of Congress facilities, the lack of planning. Years. Where is the planning? In 2009, okay. where is okay. the planning? Okay, where let's, the, let's, please pause, please pause here. It's about the people, the entire issue. Let's get some people also here. Sir, this... So many people from uh, you know neighboring areas and uh, so many residential colonies have gone to the court saying, please move this. Tell us in the past few days how bad the situation really became and you're hearing politicians speak today. Yeah, uh, the situation has been very, very bad over the last uh, uh, five, six days. It has been tremendously bad. Morning when we get up, we are not able to breathe. We are not able to breathe when we get up in the morning. Around 7.30, it is pretty bad. And uh, to the best of our knowledge, uh, a, a consent term was arrived at uh, uh, in the court whereby even the state government as well as the BMC, both of them had jointly given a uh, consent term that uh, they would not dump beyond 2000, 2000 uh, metric ton, hmm. which is the dumping limit okay. set per day. Now, they are dumping beyond that. There is no boundary wall. There is no security. Hmm. People are encroaching. Hmm. And uh, it, it is a real bad situation. And builders, entire debris is going to that area. Okay. Anil ji, कोई प्रावधान है ही नहीं यार डंपिंग ग्राउंड पे और बीएमसी की बीएमसी की आखिर में जिम्मेदारी होती है कि वहां क्या चल रहा है सरकार जमीन दे या ना दे मगर आपकी जो जमीन है वहां तो कुछ प्रावधान होने चाहिए बीएमसी का भी जिम्मेदारी है बीएमसी जीएम जिम्मेदारी अभी जैसा जी सपरा जी ने कहा कि 2012 में सभी कॉर्पोरेटर ने उसको विरोध किया था आज यह नहीं कि यह जो 2009 का 9 से लेके यह तो लगातार इसकी लड़ाई शुरू है आज मैं बोलता हूं ना कि अगर एफसीएम ने उसको विजिट किया है तो यह आग लगाई जाती है लगी जाती है इसके ऊपर छोड़ो यह जो सिक्योरिटी वहां पे है वो हम लोग हर वक्त वहां बोल चिल्लाते हैं कि वो बीएमसी म्युनिसिपल कॉर्पोरेशन को एक अथॉरिटी देना चाहिए पुलिस सिक्योरिटी एक पुलिस फोर्स फिर वो मुंबई का कोई भी हां कॉर्पोरेशन से जुड़ा हुआ मामला आपका एक सेकंड आपका जो बजट है पूरा आ, आज की तारीख में 25 परसेंट भी आपने इस्तेमाल नहीं किया है पैसे हैं आपके पास आप कर सकते हैं तो किया क्यों नहीं अंत में पैसे हैं बजट हो रहा है कॉर्पोरेटर जो जितना भी कॉर्पोरेटर झगड़ा करता है कि मुझे इतना चाहिए उतना चाहिए वो मि, मि, मिलता है नहीं मिलता है मगर वो जो पैसा आ जाता है उसके लिए वो जो अगर आगे लगाना है तो उसके लिए हर एक के पीछे एक पॉलिसी होती है हर एक के पीछे एक पॉलिसी नई नई पॉलिसी आ जाती है अभी जो कॉर्पोरेशन का ज्यादा काम है उसके लिए ई ट्रेंडिंग का सिस्टम क्यों पारदर्शिकता होनी चाहिए तो पारदर्शिकता ठीक है सर लेकिन अंत में तो आपको ही करना पड़ेगा लेट्स जॉइन आस्क जॉइनिंग अस आल्सो रितेश डॉक्टर रितेश गौतम रितेश यू नो यू हैव स्टडीड दिस यू नो यू आर स्टडीइंग फॉग एंड स्मॉग अक्रॉस द कंट्री एंड यू सॉ सैटेलाइट पिक्चर्स फ्रॉम नासा टेल अस हाउ बैड यू नो योर फ्रॉम योर ओन ऑब्जर्वेशन एंड एक्सपीरियंस एज अ साइंटिस्ट हाउ बैड डज इट रियली लुक सो तेजस दैट्स अ वेरी गुड क्वेश्चन and if i can backtrack a little uh, so when i started looking at the satellite imagery from uh, 27th of january so uh, on 27th of january there was hardly any indication of smoke activity or fires happening in the region but then uh, when we looked at 28th and 29th and 30th and uh, when i zoomed on to some uh, high resolution imagery the smoke plume actually pointed right to the origins of the dumping grounds and uh, so the interesting part was that in the media or especially in the news on 28th and 29th until 29th, uh, there was a, a lot of confusion as to what was the actual cause of such uh, deterioration of uh, air quality. And I'm glad that the imagery has actually pointed uh, right to the source, which have, uh, I think, in my opinion, in the past couple of days, the burning activity has been the uh, largest source of air quality deterioration. 
Okay, okay. Let's get a few questions for uh, from our audiences to our, our politicians. Uh, you can start, doctor. You can start. Tell us. Uh, start by telling us how how many patients really have you know have been suffering in the last few days. The number of patients that are coming to the clinics have more than doubled actually. It is almost say seventy five percent of the patients are only respiratory problems basically. Okay. You want to ask a question too? Not only I am asking the question. This is not the first case, and this will not be the first case over here. We are not interested in knowing who is ruling what. The what uh, Mrs. Varma is, uh, is saying is she is contradicting what the Chief Minister said. Chief Minister clearly said we have nothing to do with BMC is responsible. She says BMC is not responsible. Congress is responsible. This is a cockfight. In the in this cockfight, people are suffering. So, which party is running what? It is not our business. So, this should, thing should not happen at all. That okay. is the thing. Okay. Okay. We, we have one more question coming from behind here. Yeah, please. Please stand up. Uh, today only in the mirror, Mumbai Mirror, I read that there was a, uh, there were three teenagers uh, who had lit the fire over there. That means there is no security for this much of uh, this garbage area. If somebody can just come in and lit the fire okay. and the, that that fire is uh, so ha hazardous, so I think there should be some security cameras installed over there so that people can check, okay. this police can check. Okay. Uh, uh, Sanjeev, want to take that question on? Yeah. Uh, so, Tejas, uh, you know, uh, first I would like to uh, say that uh, the gentleman who said he is not interested in a cockfight between politicians, I think that's very well said, uh, though of course his language was harsh. Uh, that put aside, uh, I did not contradict the chief minister. Is the BMC responsible? Certainly so. Is the Congress responsible? Of course, they ruled Maharashtra for 15 long years. And you know, the Deonar dumping ground has today turned uh, into a veritable landmine uh, thanks to absolute ineptitude on the Congress's part. Sanju Verma, you cannot so get rid of the responsibility which you have to execute. As the fact that the BMC is responsible. You, you cannot throw the ball in other parties' court and get rid of it. You had 15 years to rule, you did nothing. Now don't, come, have to don't listen. come into TV studios. You have done something wrong. You have done something grave. Years, you did nothing. Are these are these the answers in which we can make her point? Please, Mr. Sapra, please get her make her point. Please please her make her point. Sanju, go on. Sanju, please finish your point. Please now, please do not try to, please do not try to hijack debates in TV studios after sleeping your way through 15 long years and doing zero on the governance bit, doing zero on the governance front. Now let me answer the gentleman who asked questions. Also, I think, Tejas, what is very important for your audience to know is that, yes, the BMC is, is responsible. But what people forget is that while the Shiv Sena is an ally of the BJP, let me tell you that the BMC, yes, is largely led by the Shiv Sena, which has 75 members. But do you know BJP has 31 members? Congress also has 52 members. Its erstwhile ally, the NCP, has 13 members. Between the Congress and the NCP, they have 65 members. The limited point I'm making is that while the Shiv Sena runs the BJP, uh, Shiv Sena runs the BMC and while the BJP runs the state, the Congress cannot run away from the fact that the Dionar, Mulun and Kanjur Mark dumping yard problem is a legacy yeah, issue Sumaima, that has please. been piling up for the last few okay. years. Okay, final, final comments coming in. Final comments, sir. Sumera, how can we really end this, you know, Tutu Mame, of course, we can't end, but how can we resolve this issue for Mumbai? Well, I think one of the things we need to do is to figure out what are our sources of air pollution because as I just said that definitely garbage dumping is one of them and you can see how the response is rather than taking responsibility okay. and saying we'll do it. We need to know all the sources of pollution and we need to tackle each one of them, not just garbage dumping. Okay. Uh, what do you say about this solution? The solution is... <coughs> पूरा कॉरपोरेशन के ऊपर क्लेम करके मुझे नहीं लगता है कि इससे उसका सॉल्यूशन मिल रहा है तलुजा की जगह तो स्टेट गवर्नमेंट ने हर वक्त कॉरपोरेशन जब कोई भी मुद्दा उठाती है तो वो आखिर में वही जाता है ओके जो पॉलिसी बनती है तो पॉलिसी को आखिर पास होने के लिए वहीं पे जाना पड़ता है कि यहां से आना जैसा मैम ने कहा कि कलेक्टर तो उस, उन्होंने यहां उसमें दखल देना चाहिए सीएम ने यहां दखल स्टेट गवर्नमेंट ने दखल दे, देखे ये मुद्दे को खत्म करना चाहिए आई यू यू रिग्रेट दैट दिस हैज बिकम मोर यू नो आर पॉलिटिशियंस कैपेबल ऑफ रिजॉल्विंग दिस यू थिंक 
politicians are uh, certainly capable of re uh, resolving it provided they have the will and uh, you, even i also agree uh, with uh, anil bhai what he said they also have uh, limited uh, scope hmm. to do it but as such i mean it, it has to be shifted it has to go out of chembur hmm. because we have suffered hmm. tremendously now okay. so uh, this has okay. to end and whether it moves to taloja or somewhere but this ha this needs to end but okay. if they f uh, fight jointly shiv sena uh, bjp hmm. and congress if they are all united Come together, together and this that, will never that, be solved that is the this key point from the people of mumbai from the people of chembur very clearly is saying that the bjp shiv sena and uh, the 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 uh, and the congress party all are responsible need to get together and resolve this resolve this because this is really really impacting the lives of the people of mumbai that's all we have on left right and center thanks and goodbye